Danny Sarek alongside former Cardinals quarterback, now member of our media team, Drew Sam, and this is Cardstock, presented by SeatGeek. We're so excited to debut this new series. Every week, we will look at a trend or a matchup and how that's going to play a big factor in that week's game and how the Cardinals fare against their opponent. Week one, Cardinals are hosting the Kansas City Chiefs at State Farm Stadium. Drew, it's going to be a battle of the quarterbacks. Kyler Murray and Patrick Mahomes, two dynamic mobile quarterbacks who have both played under Cardinals head coach Cliff Kingsbury. Let's start by contrasting the two quarterbacks. Where do you see the biggest differences in how Kyler Murray and Patrick Mahomes play the game? Well, I think you hit the nail on the head, but we automatically assume that they're mobile quarterbacks. Patrick will actually beat you with his arm. You see the number of times that he's been able to evade pass rushers and remain a passer and then throw touchdowns. Uh, I think you look at the career stats and you see how many more rushing touchdowns actually Kyler has 20 versus eight. That number stuck out to me when I started researching these guys of how they're really different. Uh, both are very good at being able to extend plays, but they remain passers. If you look at the other side of the coin, again, Kyler's using that, his rush attempts, but he's got to be smart with that. He's got to be calculated on when he's taking those risks. He's alluded to that. And that's, again, knowing the offense, understanding the framework of what's going on within the Cliff Kingsbury style of offense and finding your outlets. He took that step forward last year, and we look for him to do it again. You talked about how both quarterbacks can extend the plays. They can both create something out of nothing. When you look at these quarterbacks, how similarly do they play the game? I think very similar because they're used to spatial awareness. They're used to seeing all of the 21 other moving pieces of what's going on around them and utilizing all of the field to be able to do that. Not only the short, the intermediate, or the deep ball that they're able to do, but they know how to throw with touch. They know how to throw with velocity on the run and on the move. And you see these guys, and again, they're two of the most dynamic young quarterbacks in this game. They're the most fun quarterbacks to watch because no play is over until they're actually on the ground because we've seen them pull rabbits out of their hat constantly. Both quarterbacks have led to some pretty, pretty crazy highlights. When you look at Patrick Mahomes, the, the no look side angle throws, Kyler Murray being accurate on that back foot physically, how are they able to pull off those kinds of plays and still be accurate? Well, again, everybody looks up here, right? They're, they're enamored with the arm angles because they can throw from different arm angles. What they really need to focus on is their feet. The ability that they have to get that ground force, create everything, and then everything comes from the hips. So no matter where this is, this is everything in the lower half that's generating that force. And these two quarterbacks do it as good as anybody in the league. They have the ability to see everything. It's slow football to them. They are making these plays. And again, we have to limit Patrick Mahomes in doing that. And hopefully Kyler can go out there and have some really big plays for us. Mahomes was the 2020 Super Bowl MVP. He has two years on Murray in the league. And it's, you can't argue that Mahomes is one of the best quarterbacks in this league. Where do you need to see Murray fine tune his game to transcend to that level? Kyler is doing a tremendous job of staying in the pocket. He's doing a really nice job of seeing everything that's there. The next step for Kyler though, is to identify, okay, I know where everybody's gonna be out there on defense based off of film work, based off analysis. And I, I know where this ball is going before it even hits my hands. The great quarterbacks, the guys that have a long, career in this league, know where the ball is going before it's even snapped. He has the ability, he has all those physical traits, but taking that next step of feeling comfortable within everything before you even get the ball in your hands is really what we're looking for. Sunday's matchup is going to come down to the two quarterbacks. What are the keys to a Cardinals win? Turnovers. Turnovers are always key. You have to play the first half of the quarterback mistake free. You don't take risks. You have to play the first half to see what you need to do in the second half to go out there and try and win a football game. And the best thing we can do to help Kyler out as an organization is run the football. It's his best friend. It's a quarterback's best friend. And with the revamped offensive line, with James Conner back in the fold, and all of these moving pieces, yes, DeAndre Hopkins isn't there. But there's so many other guys that can put their hand in the pile, catch a football, and make some plays for us on Sunday. Kyler Murray versus Patrick Mahomes. Cardinals versus the Chiefs. It's the season opener Sunday from St. Farm Stadium. A 125 kickoff for Drew Stanton. I'm Danny Sarek. Thanks so much for watching Cardstock.